First of all, he was not shot in the head. Most people believe that he was pistol whipped. He suffered some severe lacerations. Had he been shot in the head at point blank range, there would never have been a um, Tupac death row. He'd have been dead right then and there. He was pistol whipped over the head when he tried to pull his own pistol out of his waistband in the in the heat of the moment. He was trying to pull his own pistol out and he shoots himself and that bullet goes through his leg, through his groin and back in, you know, so he um, he shoots himself. Yeah. So, for instance, in Las Vegas, Tupac had no business running over and assaulting Orlando Anderson. That was not Tupac's business. That was gang shit that Tupac shouldn't have had anything to do with. Uh, and so when he decided to take it upon himself to go and act like he was, um, you know, representing this gang, that's when he made a, you know, he made a fatal mistake. So they start putting the wheels into motion to go and retaliate. They know where Tupac's going to be. They know where Suge's going to be. They go and uh, approach a guy who um, was affiliated with Bad Boy, at least a guy that was affiliated with Puffy. And uh, they say, hey, you know, we have a beef now. This guy offers to give them a gun. He gives Keefe D, which was Orlando Anderson's uncle, a gun. They get into a car and then they set off to find Tupac and Shug. Uh, Suge Knight obviously now has lost not only his bodyguard, Jake Robles, after the shooting in Atlanta, now he's lost Tupac in Las Vegas. And, uh, you know, for all intents and purposes, they're kind of losing the war. And so, you know, he knows that he has to answer um, for the murder of Tupac. And so he sets things in motion in order to have Biggie killed. No, Suge Knight's not ever going to sit down and tell the truth to law enforcement. You got to understand who Suge Knight is and the nature of Suge Knight. I mean, he's, and Suge Knight is about Suge Knight. And Suge Knight's about Suge Knight only. He doesn't give a shit about justice. You know, a lot of people out there that are, you know, um, attaching themselves to conspiracy theories. And there's people that are out there thinking Tupac's alive. There's people that are out there thinking that Suge killed Tupac. There's people that are out there thinking the government killed Tupac. There's people that are out there thinking the police killed Biggie. So, you know, there's all of these different points of view. Um, I know what I know and I believe what I believe, and so I'm settled with that.